All praises to the Most High. Thank you, Jesus Christ, for this beautiful Sabbath day. The rest is up to me. Let's go get it. First thing I would like to do is apologize to the Arab community and to all the Muslims that's out here spreading peace. All right? Now, I had Muslims in my comments calling me a slave. All type of names, man. And the video that I did was saying enough is enough was saying me uh, stop the violence in the Middle East. That's all I was saying. And I got these comments. All right. And then they started talking about the Prophet Muhammad. See, people have to understand when I'm on the Internet, I'm an actor. So sometimes I might act, but I go far when I act, too. I get into character now. They said something about the Prophet Muhammad and all this stuff and, you know, and I apologize to the Arab community. But since we on a subject, all right, I just want to say as an African-American man, As an African American man, when you call me a slave, man, all gloves come off. <laughs> Straight up. All right. Now, let's get into it. I believe in Jesus Christ. All right. So, I'm not a Muslim. Now, I used to be a Muslim, but I dropped that flag. And, and here's why. And we're going to get into that too. As a black man, when it comes to slavery and then all y'all talk about is calling another black man a slave, that don't go lightly. So when I joined Islam, I found out that the Prophet Muhammad had slaves. Yeah. He had slaves, and supposedly he freed one, and they was black slaves, like me and you. And I said, I can't follow no religion where the prophet promoted slavery. Nah, not me. Not me, and I dropped that flag right then and there. You see, because we're going to talk about this. I believe in Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ never had slaves. Jesus Christ was the most righteous man that ever walked the planet Earth. You don't hear no smut on Jesus Christ's name. All right? He didn't have no slaves. He didn't believe in that. All right? And he was way before the prophet Muhammad. But I have none against a religion uh, like uh, Islam because the main reason why I saw it attractive because I believed in God and it seemed to me that they was more faithful to their religion than most Christians. See, on this channel, we just be honest. But when you get deep into it, you see it's just the Arab religion. No disrespect to the Arabs. But it is what it is, right? And they had slaves. And in 2017, you had Libya. They had slaves. Just recently, black slaves. Treating them like animals. Yeah. So, and they was Muslims. Yeah, Libya Muslim. So, yeah, man, I don't, um, I don't follow that religion. And Jesus Christ was the most righteous man, and ain't no smut on Jesus' name. So, just know that I'm a, I'm a follower of Christ, and I, I, I slip sometime too. You know, I didn't have to go that hard on them. And I admit that. I didn't have to go hard on the uh, Muslims and the Arabs like that. Yeah, I did. You know, sometimes I go far. And I go way far, especially when you call me a slave. <laughs> nah, ain't no stopping me now. <laughs> ain't no stopping me now. So, yeah, man, that's what happened. 
So I just want the world to know, man, that uh, I believe in Jesus Christ. That means we love everybody. Arabs, white, black, whatever you is. You know what I'm saying? Jesus Christ came to save the world. All right? So, yeah. Uh, and Jesus Christ ain't had no smut on his name. Nothing. So I'm a follower of Christ, man. And you should, too. Yeah. And uh, y'all enjoy this beautiful Sabbath day. And uh, hopefully you get some love today. Hopefully I get some love. And I don't get them Palestinians in my comments talking about kill me and all this other stuff. Because that's all the stuff they were saying, evil stuff. Like I'm scared or worried about somebody all the way across in another country. <laughs> y'all have a beautiful Sabbath day. It's your boy Abdullah Four Rilla, number one Capilla. I gotta get to him from the block, so you know I gotta get to him.